welcome to Photo Education Online. This is Larry Lursey, and today I'm going to show you a quick tutorial on using clipping masks to make your uh, adjustments much more effective. Let me show you what I'm talking about. I've got a scene here that uh, is very cool in tone. It's got uh, lots of blues in it and uh, very cool overall temperature to the scene. And let's say you want to add somebody, bring in this model here, who's obviously way too warm for the scene, was shot in a different uh, lighting situation, uh, the color balance is completely different, and way too warm to fit in the scene. Doesn't look like she fits here at all. And so obviously one of the things that we could do is go over here and do an adjustment layer with color balance, and um, you know we could make everything more blue. The problem is, uh, as it's definitely making her cooler, it's also making the background even more cool. It's not just affecting uh, our model like we would like. We want to apply an effect to her, but not to the background. And the way we do that is with clipping masks. What you want to do is you've got the adjustment layer right here selected. You're going to hold down Option or Alt, and then when you move the cursor right between it, this little box appears with an arrow. You're going to click right there. And that little arrow right there tells us we've made an adjustment layer. Now, everything we do is only going to affect this layer right there. Let me show you what I'm talking about. We go super red, all the way cyan, and it's not affecting the background at all. So now that allows us to go through, and we can just add some, uh, some cooling here. And I'll just do this quickly, just to do a little bit here, just to take some of that warmth out of her. And let's let her blend in the scene, do some highlights here. Doesn't really matter what you do um, for the point of this, per se. Just a touch more there. So there, now if we look at the uh, before and after, much better, much better fit for the scene. She's cooler. We could probably get a little closer uh, with the, the color adjustments, but um, certainly she fits in the scene here much more than that and so that's a way you can apply things and you can do this with um, any of these adjustment layers. you know say you want to do um, some levels adjustments and you only want to apply your levels to her and not to the scene same thing just do a clipping mask and it will only affect that layer so this is really good as you start doing compositing and things where you've got several different layers and you want to only be applying that effect to one thing instead of having it apply to everything below that's a really handy thing to use. So uh, again, you won't use it on every image, just something to have in your toolbox for when you're working, especially with composites with a lot of different layers. So anyways, hope that helps. If you have any questions, let me know, and uh, be sure to check back for more tutorials. Thanks a bunch. Bye-bye.